will decide to drill on west, number 627, ready at platform 4. Flight number 248 will be delayed by two hours. He's now on platform one. Attention. These have been identified.
I did it. I finally, I finally fucking did it. I made a new one. Looks much better on the big screen. I'm proud of it. I feel good about it. There we go. Now I don't look so ghostly blue. <clears throat> no longer so loved? Yeah, I didn't hide a message in that one. Well, the original one, there was like eight different ones, but I got too tired of, of choosing a different one each day. Did you figure your shit out there, camera? I got more sun this weekend than I have in a long time, yet I look more pale. It's a butte clerk. <laughs> no longer so loved. Hey, Backlog, welcome in, everybody. Good fair amount of people that came just for the reveal of a new video. <laughs> Congrats on first. Mr. Mr. V is undefeated so far this week. Beard Bogle was technically here first, but I wouldn't go live for him. Not early. Chaz, Tony, great to see you. Big D. Big D is losing track of time. Skep, skep, skep. Seek you wisdom. I miss anybody? Backlog. I just said hi, backlog. Uh, this week. The low wings of motor running now. That's right. <clears throat> Are you sure? I saw his message in chat. Bogles? Yeah, Bogle was here. Bogle was here before you. I think. I mean, I can't prove, Mr. B, that you leave. So there's that. We're talking about Chrono Trigger. I did play a one hour stream of it and I kind of fell in love with it. And then I played more of it. And what did we do? I just, I hit a boss that I, I couldn't. I played, I have 33.4 hours. So I played a significant amount of it. You can't even prove Mr. B exists. I know, right? I, I played a significant amount of it, but I hit a boss that I just, I don't know, I just wasn't fast enough for um so I mean I still got my save files I continue to try it but I stopped having fun um and that's the point where it was time for a new game I like the game I really appreciate it but no it was like it was like a boss of like I don't know let's fucking look let's see where we were I'll show you exactly where I gave up on the game I'm assuming. I'm assuming, yeah. Should have saved files. Well, what did you think of all the... And not being invisible and not random at all? And not a random surprise? Being visible. I liked that. The thing, the thing that broke me was not being able to fully pause. Constantly taking damage. I just would get caught in these loops of not being able to keep people from... Um... Passing out all the time. Uh... Um, time twenty seven. So it must be this one. So we're, I'm at some boss. Uh, well, this ain't right, is it? Maybe I, you know, maybe I beat that boss finally? I feel like I didn't beat that boss. I don't know. Hey, Deglamong. Something feels not right about this. I don't know how to actually get out of the game here. Needs a controller. Maybe didn't save near the boss? Something, something happened here. Oh, there's no load. You have to go to menu to get to quit. But you can only exit the game. You can't go back to the menu. Anyways, whatever. Ah, uh, there was there was some boss. There was some boss, and I just I just gave up on it. I just don't want to play it anymore. 
Uh, but yeah, let's do some news. Trying to think of what exciting stuff there's been this weekend. The Mousecapade continues on. Um, we got rid of that cat litter that they were interested in. And we... <sighs> trapped up to seven mice so far. Fun fact. There's my news. There's news. We trapped seven mice. Well, six. We got six, then we trapped a seventh, and then the seventh one escaped the, the cage. Uh, but we found out where they were coming in from, and it's under one of the kitchen cabinets near the dishwasher. So, solved that problem. But Hopefully, hopefully we get the last of them, and it just won't be an issue anymore. But they were eating the cat litter, cat litter's gone, and now it's... half a mouse pie. Yeah. I don't know why you were blinking. Hmm. Don't like that. <clears throat> now playing Mousetrap. Don't know that song. Hope you guys are winning. I hope so too. It's feel it's been feeling kind of kind of hopeless. They just they just they just keep coming. But whatever. The cat acknowledged one of them that was in the trap and started toying with it like an asshole. But she won't like hunt them. You have mice in your ceiling? Yeah, that happens. We had a rat in our ceiling. We caught that and we relocated it two miles. That's good. That part's good. Um, that's really been about it. Me and Dimension Dude, we beat Sniper Elite 4 on Saturday. Uh, so we'll play some DLC in two weeks. Bearded Bogle and I are going to be playing Marathon on Saturday as far as I know. Uh, he hasn't told me we aren't. So we're planning on that. Um, I played my Steam Deck pretty much all weekend, every chance I got. I was very happy. I fell asleep in the hammock with it yesterday. Uh, yes, you have. So we're not this Saturday? Are we free this Saturday? You're streaming your 24-hour stream on Saturday. Well, I guess you'll just have a guest for two hours. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, we can... I could figure something else out. I mean, God forbid that I'm bored enough that I have to come hang out with you in your 24-hour stream. Ugh. <laughs> it's probably a good opportunity for me to do some, some gardening. Wow. <clears throat> um, yeah. Look at those ads. Let's get back on the network here. So they can go away. I've been having internet issues today, so if the stream suddenly drops, sorry. Throwing myself against Skyrim for 24 hours, so that should be fun. I can promise you you won't beat Skyrim in 24 hours if you were gonna do any meaningful plays of it. <laughs> Fallout New Vegas is over, it's done, it's gone. It's uninstalled. We beat it. We beat the game. Which is amazing. Uh, we're going to be starting De Defiance, this one right here, on Tuesday. That's tomorrow night. You can speed you can speed run Skyrim in three hours. Three hours. You can you can go straight to the end boss in Skyrim. I like how I've told the world. Not planning on beating it. Have you ever beaten Skyrim? Are you not? Are you just gonna abandon the character after twenty-four hour stream? Is that is that your goal there? <clears throat> I would like to play and stream Skyrim, but it's not. It's not gonna be for a while. Thirty years on, the Batman animated series villain makes it to the comic books. It's time for Cat and the Claw to duke it out. Oh, the Claw, huh? 
Cool, cool. Red Claw. Sure. I don't know anything about it. I remember that. I remember that show. It was a good show. Hmm. I'm not sure why that's blacking in and out. I'll have to mess with that later. We'll just deal with it for now. Activision Blizzard employees form first major North American game union. Hope to inspire growing movement of workers. If they're oh Raven, Raven wins the votes. Nice. This is actually good. Uh, from everything I understand about it, Raven Software, I really like them. Raven Software, like they did Wolfenstein and Jedi Knight games. Like they were a good studio. Good studio. You suck at parking is the most extreme parking uh, experience coming to Switch. Okay. That's... That car has a cattle horn. <clears throat> now they just help make Call of Duty. It's true. It's true. But I mean, like, you remember the logo, right? The circling ravens? And then, like, yeah, the Activision logo? And... It just, you always knew you were in for a good game when you saw that. Uh, Happy Volcano has announced the hit PC game, You Suck at Parking. Come on, man. <clears throat> I don't know if it's like the extension cable or if it's, I don't know what it is. I'll, uh, I'll play with it more later. I haven't returned the other USB hub. Oh, you know what? This one does have a Cat5 plugged into the bottom. Let me just unplug that make sure that's not it. Because <clears throat> I bought two of them for the, the Steam Deck, and I was going to send the other one back that didn't have Ethernet. But I wonder if it's, like, being overloaded or something. We'll just unplug all the things that aren't in use here. There we go. No. That seems to not fix it. I feel like this is going to remind me of that one game with Georgie the Redhead, the, the Crazy Tax, not Crazy Taxi, what was it called? This looks ridiculous. Um, the one with the spinning taxi that spins like this. We played it on the one hour stream, I'm pretty sure. <clears throat> this looks like a, a multiplayer game. Roundabout, thanks Backlog, that's the one. That game is sweet. It's overly hard. I should install it on the deck. Backlog got it. Yeah, yeah, roundabout. That was good shit. This just looks like a mess. Uh, Valve made Steam Deck easy to mod and repair, and it's starting to pay off. So, you can replace any part in the Steam Deck. Fun fact, you get all the schematics and I fix it, will have every part that's in the Steam Deck for sale. Hey, old school Jay, welcome in. How are you doing? There's schematics. I wonder, they'll probably do it. There you go. Steam Deck fan. You can get a fan from iFixit now. Nice. Um, they'll probably do it where they put up their, their injection mold schematics so that you can 3D print your own stuff. <clears throat> This looks like a fleshed out version of No Break Valet. Oh Jesus. That sounds that sounds exciting. This is all good. Um after finishing working on a power pack with uh, the 18650 cells, I continue my initial plan. Uh, single lipo battery strong, okay. So this person made like a battery pack slash stand for their deck? That's cool. Pickle animal? Okay. That's cool. That doesn't look... That looks pretty good, actually. It doesn't look very... Uh, I'm gonna bookmark that. Doesn't look like it adds too much more weight. Okay, nobody cares about Reggie fils and May. Uh, Raven Software Q&A testers become the first union in the major US developer. That's gonna be the huge thing. Sony is being sued for gender discrimination at PlayStation again. 
100%. Love how camp it is, the gameplay and the cutscenes. We talking about Roundabout? I love, yeah. Yeah, what was the girl's name? The redhead with the, with the driver, right? Georgie something? Was it Georgie or Georgia? She was cool as shit. Psychedelic eyeball did voice acting in it. She was, she didn't speak. She just kind of stared at everybody that got into her cab, right? Uh, Last of Us TV show 2023 director says. It's good, it's good. Can't wait for them to like completely change who lives and dies. Gotta get, gotta get everybody pissed off about something. Uh, old school J, you wanna you wanna talk about the the movie that you were you were in and did stuff for? Feel free. Is that that's airing again tonight, right? On Lifetime. <clears throat> looks like a looks like a solid you know, romantic action movie. Old school J works in the movie industry now. U.S. Labor Board accuses Activision Blizzard of illegally threatening employees. Yep. They say that these allegations are false. V Rising devs are working on in-game sensors to fight harassment and discrimination. Fortnite and Pac-Man collaboration. Waka waka. Okay. Uh, let's see. Steam Deck line officially launches after accidental. Hey, here's all the prices, all broken down. All right, hang on. Rippin' Time premiered on Hallmark Movies Mystery yesterday and is showing all week. It's not fine art, but it's a cute romp. I enjoyed it, and I'm totally in it. Yeah, old school Jay. There's a screenshot in my Discord that shows which which soldier he was in uh, a time travel war scene. Pretty dope. So the fan, looks like the fan is $25 if you have to replace a fan. The anti-glare screen's about $100, normal screen, $64. This is a pretty cool price breakdown. $20 for the thumbsticks. Membranes, if they wear out, you can get new membranes. Speakers, speakers only $25 a piece, that's interesting. No, that speaker's plural. Interesting. Seven, six dollars for the bumper and trigger assemblies. Backplate? Oh wow, replacing the backplate's only twenty-five dollars. That's that's actually really cheap. It's way cheaper than I thought it would be. Way cheaper. Ah, you can get a new AC adapter for twenty-five dollars. That's actually pretty reasonable. Battery or screen adhesives? Okay. The daughter boards on the left and right. The motherboard's only three fifty. You can add yourself everywhere. <laughs> <clears throat> it's crazy that I bought, you know, a $600 device that I can replace parts in. In this form factor. Just fucking good on you, Val. Good on you. And you just, you know, just like a normal computer, which was the point. just not locked down technically technically somebody could upgrade the motherboard and sell an upgraded motherboard for it I don't know if they'd support that fully but it is a computer motherboard being the thing that contains all the other stuff Former Xbox exec says Game Pass might stop people buying games. Robin Atkins Down encourages uh, people to make uh, botting frustrations known to Valve. Interesting.
Metal Gear Solid 4 could have come to Xbox, but it was too complicated. Hmm. Video game's most famous circle, Batman. <laughs> Netflix is gonna put itself in the ground here in a minute. Netflix, Netflix is not doing good at all. And they've lost all worthwhile content to the other streaming services. Ugh. I'm actually thinking about canceling my Netflix because we're just not using it. There's nothing on it anymore. Plus, we've also been... <clears throat> well, I can't follow you there. Oh, the VHS tapes. Gotcha. Netflix pays your wages sometimes. The only reason I haven't canceled our Netflix is we share a sub with somebody. Well, they're trying to get rid of that too. Like really hard they're trying to they're trying to get rid of that. Someone rescued an abandoned PS3 from a swamp and now they're trying to save its life. Okay. Shared a PlayStation subreddit. Okay, you got to click through to get the one. Whoa, look at the poor guy. Saw the poor thing. Oh, fuck off. Oh, somebody put a PlayStation in a swamp. Please help donate to rehabilitate PSP. <laughs> Not gonna name names on those. In the swamp, one with the swamp. Okay, no, I don't get that reference. Oh, is this a video of the guy rescuing it? <clears throat> Just jump in, man. Toss your phone on the shore and get the fuck in there. I don't know how he's planning on picking up a PlayStation 3 with one stick. There might be piranhas in there. It's true, your feet might get stuck in the mud. It might be quick- or polar bears! Yeah. Your feet might get- it might be quicksand. What are you- oh my god, I'm skipping to the- to the- How the fuck. Okay. How did you get a PlayStation with one stick? That's not how gripping works. The stick was in there so deep. Oh, man. Alright, don't fall, asshole. Okay. A little bit of rubbing alcohol and you'll be good to go, man. Assuming there isn't a reason somebody threw it in the swamp. For <laughs> Jay! Oof. Okay. But, this is nine days ago. I need updates. Not Applebee's adverts. <clears throat> Thirteen hours ago. Have you tried switching it off and on again? No, but I did shower with it when I got home. <laughs> Put it in rice. Yep. Somebody must have rage quit hard. <laughs> this person never finished Dark Souls. But I thought the old lady dropped it into the ocean at the end of the film. Oh, man. Well, baby, I went down and got it for you. Oh, you shouldn't have.
just pulled the top cover off and fucking gagged. I swear you can hear something crawling around in there. What is, what is, hold on. Okay. You did not find that cat in there. Yeah. Yeah. Swamp. Oops, I guess we lost it. Oh, we need to know, though. We need to know. This is, this is... Come on, man. Ah! Is it still... No. Fuck. Alright. This PS3 last played Undertale for sure. That sounds like Samuel L. Jackson. Better than the usual spiders. Cockroaches love electronics, though. It's fact. <clears throat> uh, clarify, I did message the OP uh, last week post the exact same location after reading the comment and seeing mention in the same area. Also, I couldn't get there sooner due to the the commitments and also non-stop heavy rain. Blah 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 blah. Off work now. Probably resolder the ports. New thermal paste might even need a new disk drive. I'm guessing the motherboard is working. The motherboard is dead. I don't see a reason for anybody to trash a perfectly working PS3 in a, into a swamp. Also, a lot of things down here. Blah 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 blah. blah. All you need is an entire new PlayStation 3, this one says. Oh yeah, that is that is the place. That's the exact place. It just flooded more. So that thing's so heavy that like it flooded hard and didn't move any. Um, it's just a different perspective from. Uh... Yeah, see, he's on the dock, so it's like rotate 90 degrees. Interesting. You never seen an IRL cockroach? No cockroaches. No Applebee's. Uh, have I really lived? You don't want to see cockroaches. Cockroaches are bad, bad news. Okay, there it is. We've done the news. That was our that was our feel good story. Somebody's trying to resuscitate resuscitate a PlayStation 3. The worst console ever made. <laughs> Actually, I think we want to do this in the other one, but we'll switch to that here in a minute. Alright, so, Sean Beanland bought me a game. It's Final Fantasy 12. I mean, 7. V-I-I. -I. Yes, 7. And I'm actually going to play it, unlike that game that Seek bought me. <laughs> Which is going to be on Friday. Wait, that was feel good? Yeah, it was pretty feel good. I mean, what was the other thing? Activision and Blizzard continue to be shit. Um, they're getting they're getting some um, uh, some unions going, which they desperately needed. That's pretty good. I don't know if that's feel good. Somebody rescuing some technology. I feel. I think that's feel good. The finalist and most fantastic, right? Figure out which year goes where here. My neck is kind of kinked up from the uh, all that hammocking yesterday. You'll feel good when all your friends in the game were... I agree with that. I agree with that. It seems like there's a bit of a roller coaster going on with Blizzard Activision right now. And Raven. Wins and loses and... <clears throat> um, Cool. So I put a mod on this to help smooth over some issues that the PC port has. And the Steam version is... 
from everything I can tell, it is the CD-ROM version from back in the day, except that it has a launcher and settings. And this one kind of made me chuckle a little bit. You have to toggle Cloud Sync up here, but it does have Cloud Sync. Uh, so this game could be continued between the Steam Deck and the PC. Though I think if I started playing this on the Steam version... What? Some places you can just drag it around from, and some places you cannot. But yeah, there you go. It also has an out-of-the-game achievement thing. It's not built into the game. Which really does just kind of drive home that this may be like some kind of emulation. They're not releasing the new Diablo game in the Netherlands. Cloud Sync, real clever guys. <laughs> oh. Whoops. Not that. I want this. We'll do the other control alt thing. Let's see what you did there. How you doing, Nigel? Um. Yeah, give me just one second here. There we go. I didn't quite line it up perfect. Damn it. I can do it better. Uh -huh. It's what you get. It's what you get. And everybody was happy. <clears throat> so the only Final Fantasy game that I've really played besides Final Fantasy 1 on the NES was... Uh... Um... Hey, Grey Bearded Gamer. Welcome in. Uh, was Final Fantasy 13. We did it on the one-hour stream. That one I've been meaning to get back to. And I will one day. I don't know if I'm going to stream it. That's not really anybody's favorite Final Fantasy, but it's the one that actually appeals to me. Uh, but this was a gift from Sean for the one, for the 500th one-hour stream. Uh, and we're going to do it. We're not going to play the whole thing. We're just doing the one-hour stream. Uh, which may completely be taken up by this opening cinematic that wasn't skippable until you put a mod on it. <laughs> a jar of peanuts, long-term memory. Ooh, new Assassin's Creed. I know at least one person like that, Sean Beanland. Also, every single person here in chat streams. So y'all should follow each other. It's a fun fact. And you're all awesome. It's also the only one you've ever played and you've never finished it was this one here. Yeah, Nigel, Nigel Neverland um, <clears throat> also works uh, with suicide prevention charities as well. Uh, Bearded Bogle is the guy that I run my charity event with every year. 
Well, Foundation 45 is uh, who Nigel fundraises for, which is uh, a Texas-based, um, started from the band scene. Come on, newcomer, follow me. <clears throat> I'll tell you this for free. The 15 FPS versus the 60 FPS fight patch is night and day difference. I needed much less volume in that music. How are volumes for everybody? Everybody good? <laughs> You're allergic to 90s JRPGs that aren't Chrono Trigger? You could never get into this one? <clears throat> I don't like random encounters. This is not my kind of game. Which I believe is part of the joke of why it was gifted to me. But... We're, we're, we're gonna do we're gonna do the the one hour stream treatment and see where that gets us you know I don't know Jay I don't know it's good music I mean it's just the steam version so it's not using any MIDI hardware did this one ship with MIDI would that be in Hang on a second. On, on one of my my demo discs or Square Enix IDOS game discs, I have a demo for a Final Fantasy game. Uh, it might be this one. I'm not sure. Um, but what? We could probably fire that up at some point and see how it sounds. It supported a few different sound standards like A3D. Nice. Bogle got his new PC this weekend, which is awesome. God, that is a slow walk, though, ain't it? <clears throat> How come nobody saw that coming? We got oh I don't like that I don't like the way that you can't you can't stop it I think in the menu you can change it to um, you can change it to full stop on on attacks active battle waits the duck menu I couldn't help but notice that I just got humped by a dog either, Chaz. It was, uh, hey Don Tallinn, it's great to see you. And Mac Lad of the Duck Menu.
What? So, hold on, you can change corners? Why? Why is this a thing? I love it, but I don't understand why. Why? It's beautiful now. There, I've improved the game. Look at how amazing that is. Wow, you're from Soldier, all right. <clears throat> Still can't believe one of the, one of their guys has joined up with a group like Avalanche. But soldiers are the enemy. A beautiful rainbow toad, isn't it? I love it. I love it, it's perfect. It's time to redo all of my layouts and themes in that. <laughs> Jesse, what's he doing with us? No, no, Jesse. He's not in soldier anymore. He quit Shinra. I didn't catch your name. All right, chat, we need a name. Who volunteers? I'll probably, I'll probably leave the other people's names in case for some reason we need a walkthrough. Uh, but we can rename Cloud. Or is that heresy? Do you not do that? I renamed everybody in Chrono Trigger and regretted it. Because it was talk like guys were talking about how to use people's attacks, and I was just like, I don't know who the fuck that is. Havoc it is then. Cannot use the keyboard here. Rename him Zack, that won't come back to haunt you at all. I don't know if I get the reference. Okay, I'm. I don't care what your name is. Once this job finished, I'm out of here. You can't give away the uh, the reference. Oh no. Okay. The hell are you all do when I told you never move as a group. Our target is Mako Reactor One. We'll meet in the bridge in front. They all moved as a group. Ex soldier, huh? Don't trust you. Yeah, well, you're, you're gonna... Ah. Uh, you're gonna be Barrett. You can run by holding X with directions. Try to keep up. Is there anything worth exploring in any of this right now? Or do I just follow them? This feels like prologue. Like the kind of prologue where you don't get to keep anything you find if you were to find anything. <laughs> Cloud hair? Oh god. Uh, my hair is too thick for that. I've tried to do Liberty Spikes. Uh, when I was in high school. It's just $5. It just doesn't work. My menus are beautiful, though. Oh, man. No. Oh, my God. I start getting bald patches, I'll cut my hair. But that's going to be, like, the only thing that makes me do it.
So wait, hold on. Are they actually waiting now? Well, they are attacking. <clears throat> but do they now wait for me to take my turn? No. Then what was wait for? An hour of Final Fantasy VII, huh? Yeah. How you doing, Warlock? Welcome in. A blonde cloud wig? Oh my god, do you know how warm that would be? When you go into the magics or items? Okay, so it's kind of like Chrono Trigger. Ugh. I'm staying here to secure the escape routes. Jeez, we're really gonna blow this huge reactor. Uh, it'll be a some sight, that's for sure. I just wanna walk across the fucking bridge. I like his sword spin, though. Disc 4 by 51 minutes? <laughs> Screen tearing is noticeable for all y'all. Well, yeah, look at that. Well, we have to redo everything if I were to save it and change it, so... Because you can't save this game anywhere, turns out. It was a real pain in the ass for testing. Um, it's because I have it set for 144 hertz and we're uh, capturing at 60. I can fix it. I just can't do it without having to redo everything we just did. Because I have to restart the game. Extra stream game for 40 more hours? No. No. Defiance is next. I've been wanting to play Defiance for, like, since November. I should have just done it. Yo, you... You've been in a reactor before, right? Yeah, I mean, I was with she Company. The planet's full of Mako energy. People use it every day. But they ain't got no clue what it is. How about you? <clears throat> Alright, I'll tell you. Exposition. The Mako's the lifeblood of our planet, but she is using it all... This weird crap around here to suck it dry. Oh, spare me the speeches. Let's just do this, okay? Right. You're with me from now on. So I have played the demo for the remake of this game, so I kind of know what's going on with the reactor. Well, that it's a place, basically, and we got bosses coming up. Okay, push these buttons. Is the part of your leg followed by the Egyptian god? Okay. <clears throat> Shin... Shinra? Okay. I gotcha. Um, no. <laughs> the reactors are slowly draining away the planet's life. And one day, that'll be it. Cloud doesn't give a fuck. I'm not interested. Sorry, but I'm not interested. Don't you get it? The planet's gonna die. I just want to get this job done before the Robo Guards arrive. I shake my fist in anger. A 
Hello. See, you were, I was just thinking about climbing that ladder, and it was like, no. Have some randomness. Change. Oh, we got a sneak attack, maybe. Attack him. What? The minigun arm's pretty rad, though. Da -da -da. I like this tune. Right here. Oh, I can climb it. Nice. Okay. This game... Y'all remember when we tried to play Septera Core? I really wanted to love that game. But that was some of the least fun I've had on a one hour stream. That game, that game is just too clunky. Cool attack. <clears throat> no, you're not allowed to miss. We also don't get to see their their uh, their health, I guess. Really, Don? Oh, there was stuff here. Potion, huh? Pain gill. So, do we... Can I do a scan ability? No. Alright. So, we don't... We don't regain health points here. Right, notes? Potion restores 100 HP. That'd probably be good. Ether, mana points. Restores an ally who's knocked out. I got five potions. Alright, so we'll, we'll heal up. We'll heal up. Cloud. But what was other? What's other? Oh, order key items. Got it. No magic. You got any magic? What's limit? I don't know what that means. Form? What does this do? Formation? Does that mean I lead with him? No. Is that the fighting formation? You scan, you get detailed information. Limits a special attack that charges up over time, okay. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Sean's like, no, put him in the bag. Okay. Does that stand for formation? Alright, there it is. Press O! Or whatever it is on the controller here. You'll know when it's available during battles. Okay.
Hey Jedi Mega Man, thanks for the lurk. Appreciate you. I would have slipped and fallen on my ass for that. The music in this is really, really good. There's a save point! Oh my god. You know what the worst part is? When I was testing earlier today, like, before the mod, uh, you couldn't skip cutscenes. Or I didn't know how. In the mod, they added the ability, and I, now I know what the, you know, what the controller combo is for because it's in their instructions. But I couldn't save, so every time I I changed my settings and tried to, you know, screw with frame rates and install patches and whatnot for this game, um, I'd have to sit through like a five-minute-long intro video, and then, you know, deal with everybody jumping off the train and getting to the first fight. I made it to this ladder before I gave up looking for a place to save. This is how far I played. And it was here at a fucking save point. Typical. I'm, I'm actually mad about that. <clears throat> so while it's in the menu with me that I take everywhere, I can only do it here, I guess. But here it is. Here's the save point. Ten slots, okay. That was interesting. How do I get out of here? How do I get out of here? Oh, that's just backing up a menu. Alright, got it. So we have made... Damn it. We've made a save point. Now. Trying to ass oh my god. A restore materia. Okay. I don't know how Barrett fits in my pants though. Fun fact, he just appears out of nowhere. When we blow this place, there ain't gonna be nothing left but a pile of rubble. Go on, set the bomb. You shouldn't do this. What? I'm too busy. Oh, you should do this. I'm too busy watching you do it. Try not to disappoint me. <laughs> Wake up. This is more than a reactor. That was painful in my ears. Is it? Huh? I said, what is it? Come on, hurry up. Yeah, sorry. Heads up. This one looks like the real deal. Oh, I remember this boss from the remake. Hey, Dragon Jim, welcome in. <clears throat> Search scope. Open fire. Blizzard? Did I just blizzard on myself? No. Oh, there's a limit. Braver? Okay. Am I doing good? I see the limit bar now. Why does no one believe you're turning 46? Well, last year, you definitely said you weren't going to tell anybody your age. So, I'm inclined to not believe that you told us your age. <laughs> I think we talked about this a couple weeks ago. Hey, Bear, watch out. What? Hmm. 
yeah, robots. Just like the rest of us turning 29. God, I wish I was turning 29. I'm about to turn 39. I don't like the feeling of that. Because we all like the 12-year-olds. <laughs> We ain't doing so good here. Can I get to healing stuff here? I'm gonna die, aren't I? Yeah. Okay, bye, Barrett. Item? How do I get to item? Did I use the- I don't think I did. Did I just use the item on him? Motherfucker. Potion, on him. Okay. Twenty-five and fifty is a null zone. Yeah. I don't want to get fucked by no scorpion tail driller. Got him. All right. I was getting. I was getting nervous there. <laughs> a little nervous. Assault gun. The alarm. Come on, let's get the hell out of here. Ten minutes to detonation. Oh, there's a big old timer there, isn't there? The assault gun is more... It's better, right? It's better. Hey, Haggard Hessian. Thank you so much for the raid. Bang. Okay. Well, we upgraded somebody something. Thanks, Matt Glad, for the shout-out. Hey, Joe McGuy. How was y'all stream together today? <clears throat> No! No! Don't you understand, though? Wow, the timer doesn't stop here? Thanks, game devs. Oh yeah, there it is. There's the new gun. We should've healed. Maybe. Slow but steady progress. Ooh, you got fucked up. Well, let's go. I like this tune. We're gonna have to spam some health potions here. Good, we got another one. That's good. So it's 58 right now. Uh, items. Potion. And you. Potion. And you. Let's just do it. We'll just we'll just heal. Gatling gun just chilling. Alright, let's go! <clears throat> Find a maiden yet? I think I can save. Can I save right now? Of course not. I'm standing at the save thing though. But it's probably because the timer's up, huh? Hello? Can I go through this door? Do I have to climb all the way back out? Oh, no. 
getting some flashbacks to Metal Gear Solid 3 right now. Yeah, this room looks amazing. Oh no, they got a back attack. Can't dodge. I'm the hero. Oh my god. It takes five seconds for him to sword twirl. <laughs> You'll be humming it in the nursing home walls, right, MacLad? Have you alright? Gosh, I got my legs stuck. <laughs> Thanks. We could have gone together. I don't know why we just leave Brooke. Ocarina of Time Tunes. This, this scene right now looks like Metal Gear Solid to me. Do you think something with only one leg has the stability to fire a mouth shooting gun? this there was an area oh shit there was an area in here we didn't explore but there's some kind of like loot box or something over there we're gonna get distracted this is what's gonna cause us to die at least there's like some level one enemies here never I'll never run from a battle shoulder buttons, you think? Oh, sweet. It's a phoenix tail. It's not gonna help us when the reactor goes critical. Come on! Okay, but stay alert. Go fuck! Hit the fucking button! I don't know why you need my permission. I'm the new guy. Negative on the, uh... Negative on the leaving. I don't know what's happening. Okay. Hey, deactivated styles. How you doing, my friend? Never running. We are having. <laughs> Is that Mario over there? Guarding the escape route. Come on. We gotta pick him up. No, you guys need to leave. I'll never run from a battle. Ruby Weapon has entered the room. Ruby Weapon. <clears throat> I will tell you this for free. That sound? On in-ear earbuds? It's awful. Truly awful. Uh... That should keep the planet going uh, a little longer. Yeah. Oh, thank God it's over. Also, how you doing today, Skip? Done. Now stand clear. Got more things to blow up. That was a pretty good explosion. 
Okay, got his ass burned. Alright, let's head back. We'll rendezvous in District 8 Station. At the District 8 Station. Remember to board the train separately. Uh, like we don't know each other. Hey, wait. Look, if it's about money, leave it for the hideout. Fellow flower seller, excuse me. Oh, yeah, that's right. Her and her flowers. I got a vague recollection of this. I haven't played this game in, in ages. My copy's in storage with the other PSX games. That's a bummer. Just nowhere to put the collection at the minute. I, I'm feeling this. I'm feeling this. Back here, I've got, like, a stack of, like... Like, my, my consoles are here. Some of my cables are here. <laughs> Um, in the closet. Those yellow, those yellow bins behind the red computer, all of those guys are, uh, PC and console games that I've either done on the one hour stream or I'm not planning to get to for a while. And then these guys down here have controllers and joysticks. Like, it's starting to really close in on me in here until we get the, the remodel. Um, and then the vast majority of my PlayStation and um, uh, Xbox games are on the other side of this wall where the TV is. The only console games I have in here are like, there's all the Wii games. Haggard still smells, it's true. <laughs> no. No. Um, this one, Tuesday we're playing Defiance. And then after that, we're going to play Zero Population Count. Those are the extra stream games coming up. So starting tomorrow, because we're done with Fallout New Vegas forever, it's uninstalled, we beat it, we got the ending we, we feel like we deserved, uh, we're going to start playing some Windows 95. Um, Windows 98, 95 era PC games again. Which is, I can't wait to get back to that. Uh, <clears throat> I've got no plans to full play Final Fantasy 7. Be very clear about that. <laughs> that doesn't mean now play it on hardcore mode. No. You no. You, you finish the game, Skep. You finish the game. You punch your way through the end of that game. And then I'll think about playing another uh another Bethesda game. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Bogle, thanks for hanging out, dude. It was nice to have a voice chat with you today, too, by the way. Um, so we're not going to be doing anything on Saturday, me and Bogle, so I'm free. Maybe I can take my dog for a walk or something. It was 27 streams. It was 27 streams, Jay. It definitely drug on, but it never got, like, it never, like, hit a thing where I was like, I don't want to play this anymore. It was more of, I want to play something else, but... Hey, thanks for the friend request, DX Base Styles. I will, I will add you uh, when I get out of the game. <clears throat> um, but... I, I liked the way it ended. I mean, I liked the game. I really did like the game. I still, I still think that I like Fallout Three more, and that is going to be all on the setting um, and the story. The story for this one for me was whatever, but I don't think anybody really loves the story of Fallout New Vegas. I think that it has infinite role playing and endings is what people like about it, and I can see that, and that works for me. Like, I got an ending out of the ones that were set up that I felt like I wanted. Um, and I don't feel like I need to see the other ones. This game on Steam, it definitely goes on sale. Um, I'm using I'm using a mod. I'll share the mod that I installed real quick. Hang on. 
Don't crash my game. The reunion, it's called. The reunion. <clears throat> but it adds, it fixes some functionality. I have not played Fallout 4. You know, there was like a minute as I was finishing New Vegas where I was like, I'll just fire up Fallout 4. No, that's not when it was. It was when um, I was watching Steetech Gaming was playing Fallout 4 and I'm like, this looks much better. <laughs> There's a hot take. But no, it's going to be a while before I play. Before I play another big game like that. The next game that I want to play that's open world is Outcast. Um, and I, I wanted to do that really soon. Old, uh, ALVS Joe just started playing that kind of out of the blue, and I'm just like, damn it. So I'm probably going to wait a bit on that. That one's been that one's been on my, like, do it this year list uh, in a big way. Because <clears throat> it's got a sequel coming, and that game looks incredible. <laughs> what was this one called? What was the link? We'll just go here. Here, everything's here. For anybody that... Oh. Sorry, it's on a different computer. Anyways, you go to the PC Gaming Wiki. The Reunion mod's here. Tells you what it does. Um, looks like it adds like 99 quests to it, which is cool, I guess. Hidden items? I don't know. Memory patch. Um, uh, model overhaul. Improved characters. 60 FPS battles. Uh, in games, text translation fixes, menu overhaul, makes them line up better, it fixes the fonts. Other things in the game a little bit smoother. But yeah. <clears throat> I haven't seen anything in this, um, you know, be a deal breaker for me. There's been, yeah, yard work. Yard work is a thing right now. We're trying to get the garden beds ready for planting. Um, and my back's been acting up, so my wife's been doing like a large part of it. We just dug up a big swath of land in the backyard. Excuse me. Do you know what happens? You better get out of here. Don't worry about it. Hey. Not every day you see flowers. No, never mind. Oh, these are conversation options. I get it now. Oh, these? You like them? They're only one gill each. Sure. Well, thank you. Here you go. Da -da 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 -da. Is that the sound? Okay. I bought a flower. Is that good? Enjoy the mini arcade you made? Nice. So can I read environment things? Is there anything explorable in the environment? Um, or am I just button mashing in vain here? <clears throat> also, welcome into the Discord. Uh, DX Base Style. It's great to have you. Let's, uh, let's take a look at what Deactivated Styles made here. Oh, this is adorable! Alright, hang on. Coming up. Y'all here? Okay. Oh, look at all these little guys. Space Invaders. Two Space Invaders. Two Pac-Mans. Mrs. Pac-Man, I think. Contra. I like those. I like... I like the... Oh my god. I love the little mini posters in the background. <laughs> That's adorable, dude. This is great. Nice work. <laughs> oh, neon lights. That looks cool. Super cool. Uh, those are complete in box. Nice. How fun. I have a video of the lights doing their thing. Cool. What the hell just happened? There are a bunch of people running around. What's that on the wall? Let's see. 
Don't be fooled by Shinra. Mako energy won't last forever. Mako is the life of the planet. So this is like Gaia or whatever. Um, the, the, the spirit of the planet. And someday it will come to an end. Saviors of the planet, Avalanche. Soldier, hey you. Shinra soldiers, eh? Take them out. No, they're not worth the pulp. What? I didn't do anything. What's happening? God damn it. Don't you know I was one of you once? Is there a magic that does area attack? I feel like I need that right now. Blizzard Thunder. Thunder Clap. That's what you get. This is Climate Comet? Well, only because we haven't stopped polluting our goddamn planet. Soldiers wield guns. Members of soldier tend to have swords. What? Soldiers and organizations. Soldiers are different? <clears throat> that's as far as you go. Sorry, but I don't have time. Yeah. That's- I can't read any of that. It's going way too fast. We're gonna have to slow down the auto text, I think. <laughs> Looks like Havoc didn't make it. You think they got him? Don't bet on it. That guy wouldn't let anything get in the way of his goddamn cash. <laughs> So you think you'll go on fighting for us? The hell would I know? Do I look like a mind reader? Damn it! Humph! It's cause you screw ups. It's cause of you screw ups I hired that jackass in the first place. Oh yeah, Barrett about the pay. Uh oh. Uh, nothing. Side. Oh, there's no money? Fuckers. Late for our appointment. You're damn right you're late. Come flying in here making a big scene. Not really, just what I always do. Ugh, oh, jerk. Getting everyone worried. Don't care don't care about no one but yourself. <clears throat> Switch to four eighty P and it looks exactly like how you remembered it. Nice. Oh, you were worried about me. What? Ha, it's coming out of your share, Hotshot. Yo, people, we're moving out. Follow me. We get cross shot by the entire cast.
Let's keep this up for the next mission. Careful, I'll shut this. You need havoc your face, it's pitch black. What? There you go. Hey, thanks for saving me back there in the reactor. Could we have left her or him? Hey, Rush Pirate. Ugh, ugh, okay. This is the last train departing from District 8. Our final stop will be District 7. Train Graveyard. Ex expected time of arrival is 23 minutes after m what, Midgard time. Sure. Did he just scare off the punk kids for no reason? Arr, nice. This is why I hate the last train. Who oh boy. Why couldn't they just sit in the seats like normal people? Um. Hey Havoc, I wanted to want to look at this with me. It's a display of the train route. It'll be fun to watch together. I'll explain it to you. I'm into this kind of thing. Bombs, monitors, you know, high-tech stuff. Okay, it's about to start. JRPG badasses don't sit like normal people. <laughs> yeah, I've never played this game before, Rush Pirate. This is a wireframe model of Mako City Midgar. It's one ten thousand scale. The top plate is about 50 meters above the ground. A huge pillar supports the plate in the center, and there are smaller ones on each district. The smaller pillars are known as mechanical towers. We destroyed reactor one on the northern edge. They're numbered in order. Two, three, up to reactor eight. Mako reactors help provide electricity to Midgar. Each district had a name once, but no one remembers them. Today we just use numbers. That's the kind of place this is. Phew. Next, we have this. Take a look. <clears throat> this is the route our train is on. The tracks spiral around the central pillar. You've only recently played Six for the first time? Thirteen's the one that I, I really want to play, and I will I will get to it eventually. Based off of class and power? Yeah. Well, I you know, I like I like the non fantasy setting of this. Like the sci fi setting and the steampunk to this is great. And it's not just some majestic shit. Exactly. That's kind of where I'm at with Final Fantasy deactivated. Same same place. Um, that just... The, the fantasy setting of them doesn't do much for me. It's like additional slog that I have to get through with random encounters. Which is why 13 and this one. Um, I'm starting to feel this one more, more appeal to me. And what I like about, you know my science fiction <clears throat> there was one I saw Sean playing that was pirates I don't remember which number that was but they had like ships and stuff that one seemed pretty cool it looked really good I think was that like six or eight maybe Sean remembers it's one of the ones you full played on stream Right now, we're about halfway. Each transit point has an ID check area. It scans information from all the passengers. The cross checks the data with the host computer in the Shinra building. Airships are a common thing? Oh, okay. 
We definitely look suspicious if we're using fake IDs. So we're using fake IDs. Speak of the devil. Those red flashes mean we're passing through an ID check area. Because when the lights go out, these trains are full of pervs who can't keep their hands to themselves. Well, enough about that. We're almost home. What a relief. Snore, he 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 he. Barrett's being so bossy. Please, you'll bother the other passengers. Oh. Uh. Look, you can see the surface. But this place has no day or night. It's only, it's only that damn plate. Oh, uh, there. We'd be looking at the sky now. A city suspended in the air. Pretty unsettling scenery. Huh? Never expected that out of you. You're just full of surprises. I want to see it. The world above, the city on a plate. It's cause of the rotten pizza. People below are suffering so much. What? Mako pollution rains down on them. <clears throat> the air is filthy. Because it's got nowhere to go. And nothing's being done to clean it either. Rotten pizza, the plate's above, I guess. He's calling the city a pizza. Alright. On top of that, the Mako reactors keep pumping out energy. Thanks to them, the land's gone completely barren. Then why doesn't everyone just move up above? Don't know, probably can't afford it, or maybe. Because they don't want to live on a plate, they prefer to live under their feet. Uh, no matter how poisoned it is. I want pizza. Not city pizza, though. Well, maybe city pizza, maybe New York pizza, but not city plate pizza. When you think about it, the lingual in lingual in this game is kind of odd. They really made these characters illiterate. I have to assume that's all translations. Yeah, frequently spotty. Like, there's so many words in here, they just, the translating crew did the bare minimum amount of work. It's like me when I'm in Bogle stream and I just type something really fast and slam enter and hope for the best. Or any chat. I do that in all of your streams. Fun fact. Yeah, it's either city plate or word salad. Or city city pe plate pizza or word salad. Those are the dinner choices. <laughs> There's fan translation mods that fixes some of the quality of life things. That's what I'm playing right now, Rush. I'm playing Reunion. So you're saying it's still a mess. <laughs> <clears throat> Reunion also had some great things like D-pad support. That wasn't a thing that worked before I installed it. It's rotten because they made it with pineapple? Well, you could die in a fire. <laughs> I think I've been to this restaurant where it was word salad or uh, city plate pizza. Oh no. I'll tell you this for free. Um, any place that sells like buffet pizza, you don't want to get a salad from. That is going to be one nasty salad. Like Zero Wing? Uh, Japanese to English book. One translation. Yeah, yeah, I've got, I've got Reunion installed. Um, he did that so that some of the fight scenes could be not 15 FPS. The game is still mostly 30 FPS, like right now it's 30 FPS. But that transition into the fights where it panned the camera, at 15 FPS would have given me a headache. I'm sensitive to like sub 40 FPS ever since I got LASIK surgery. Don't know why. I don't know why. But like, anytime there's a camera panning, if it's not smooth... It's like 
It's like somebody's like flicking the inside of my brain. <clears throat> yeah, I understand. No one lives in the slums because they enjoy it there. Yeah, that'll help. Thanks, Gap. Uh, this helps with the Japanese translation as well when you convert the images to letters. Um, you can see there at the bottom right is the word City Plate Pizza. Um, which is which actually is Star Wars Stormtrooper. I'm here to help. They're like this train. It can only run where the track's been laid. That is my favorite filter, though. I should work on making more filters, but... Why? When this one just knocks it out of the park so well. Oh shit, I'm in the wrong scene. No, I'm not. What's happened here? Oh! Oh! Fucking interesting. That was the filter that did that. Huh, okay. Hey, get over here, you, all of you. So that filter added the black bars to the side. I'll have to dig around and see if I can fix that. <clears throat> Eventually. That mission was a success, but don't get careless. The big one's still to come. Not getting cold. No getting cold feet. Because the next one's really going to wake him up. Okay, bye, Barrett. Meet back at the hideout. Move out. <sighs> when you've been a train attendant as long as I have, you see a lot of people in a lot of situations. People meeting, parting, joy, sadness. After a while, it doesn't even get to you anymore. <clears throat> I wonder how long it's been. You end up laying an invisible rail between yourself and the passengers. It's a train pun. If you don't get caught if you don't get caught up in their lives, me. I'm just a train attendant, plain and simple. It's an easy it's easier this way. Why you know work. You staying with me tonight? Oh. How about we take it easy somewhere? Oh. But there's something, only the train graveyard around here. And they say it's haunted. Damn. What? Okay. I don't know why that didn't work. Ah, you got ripped off. Why it went did like that? Always gonna be something breaking, right? Oh, is it working? It did. It did. Okay. Oh, I thought that was the green filter one, and so it did work. Okay, great. Good. That's what we want. That's what we want. I guess we're gonna fight some trains. <clears throat> yeah, dogs don't really give a shit when it's time to jump up on a person. Sword or not, they're they're gonna jump up on you. Gil is money, right? So is there a reason to be up here? Like a hatch or something? Or just just a place? Doesn't matter? Jump to something else? It is later on a place? Oh, okay. 
Uh, so I must be going the wrong way then. So we'll go this way. Save <coughs> <laughs> hey! The hell are you doing here? Butt out, jeez. Oh, you came to see it too? I hear there was a terrorist attack above. Makes you think. If this tower ever came down, the slums would be dust. Well, no use in worrying about it, is there? Check it out, though. It's this, it's this awesome no matter how many times you look up. Yeah, show me. Look at those fucking rickety-ass stairs. Pretty neat here, huh? This is my special place, but feel free to drop by from time to time. Well, take care, bro. Did he just run in to fire a machine gun? He did, didn't he? What a dick. Wow. I don't think we're the good guys. You heard what's happened? Right? <sighs> no, what? Really, it's been all over the news. There's been a terrorist attack up above, and guess what? The target was the Mako Reactor. Yay! Uh, you know what this means? No, what? You see, I keep on top of things like this, and it stands to reason. When the power's knocked out, computers, traffic, lights, and so on, are all going to be knocked out as well. They must have been about, hmm, easily a billion gill worth of damage. I'm not interested, right? <clears throat> uh, I reckon, I reckon a lot of innocent bystanders lost their lives. If the explosion had been in the middle of the night, well, at least they'd have gone in their sleep. Wait, we killed everybody? We're not the good guys, are we? Are we the bad guys? That that person down there next to the redhead looks like one of the twins from that game. <laughs> Here's a gunman shooting up the town square. I'm not interested, right? Alright, go on. Oh, come on. What the hell's going on tonight? It's been weird ever since the long blackouts earlier. Get your slow ass moving. Get your slow moving. Get off your slow moving. I'm running around talking to people. Word. Word is. Was caused by some terrorist bombing up the reactor up above. I was having a quiet beer and watching the news. The next thing I know, I'm getting thrown out. It really pisses me off. Bear, you're a dick. <clears throat> Daddy? Oh, no. No. Did you shoot the bartender? Morin. Aren't you going to say hi to Havoc? Oh. This is my dad. Welcome back, Havoc. Looks like the mission went well. Did you argue with Barrett? Yeah. I might have known. That's so typical of Barrett. <laughs> and when you were little, you got into fights at the drop of a hat. I was kind of worried. So there's there's Tifa, the Tifa that everybody talks about. The the Tifa who had a cleavage introduction in the remake, is that correct? Oh, 
Flowers are so rare these days. Oh yeah, that's right, I bought flowers. They hardly ever grow in the slums. But if someone gave you a flower... Oh, I get it. It's not what you think. Give it to Mara. Do you like your flower? Looks like Marin is shy. Biggs. Why don't you get to rename everybody? Why is it just certain people? I guess it doesn't really matter, but... <clears throat> Nothing like that. First drink after a job. Uh, hiccups. How about you, Abby? Care for a beer? Sure, why not? That's more like it. Y'all are buying, right? With the money that you definitely were going to pay me because I'm a merc? Even if you were a soldier. You can rename people who end up in your party. So Tifa's in my party. Nice. Even if you were a soldier, you're still a rookie here. And rookies do what their superiors say. Are you the leader? Gosh, I feel all excited. Oh my. I wonder why. Because you're drunk. It's an arcade machine. Cowboy something. Draft beer. <sighs> Ugh. Uh, you keep the secret from Barrett? What? what? What did I keep? Secret from him. Oh, Havoc! Tifa really knows how to cook. Munch, 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 munch. Anyways, I want to tell you something. I'm not interested in your stories. Tifa always lets me taste her cooking. And look at me now. I'm roly-poly. <laughs> Don't know whether I should be happy or sad, but it's good food and the drink that's, that's put this place on the map. Oops. And, uh, I don't know. What am I keeping a secret here? That sounds dirty. I know. I know. I almost followed it up with a, if you know what I mean. Oh my god. Barrett's problem. Daddy, you're home. Oh, so Marin's Barrett's kid. Yeah, Daddy's back. Hmm. What's with the flower? Some loser gave it to me. <laughs> Habit gave it to me. Huh. And did you say thank you? Thank you for the flower, Havoc. I'll take good care of it. Hi, Barrett. <clears throat> Yo. <laughs> Guys, we're starting the meeting. Oh. I guess that's why it didn't work. It wasn't plugged in. Well, while everybody's gone, I'm gonna go talk to Tifa. Take a seat. In the remake, she's Marlene? Really? How about... Something to drink. Make it strong. Just a second. Be ready in no time. One hour, two hours in, jump some. You act like you've never been here before. Welcome in, it's great to see you. <clears throat> I will officially change this stream to the two hour stream if y'all donate a thousand dollars to the Kofi page. Fun fact. <laughs> it's good to see you, jump some. Bribery, yes, it is. It's always the two hour long, one hour stream. Till, till somebody donates a thousand dollars and explicitly says rename the one hour stream to the two hour stream I'm relieved that you made it back safely what's with you all of a sudden that job was nothing I guess not you were a soldier but not a soldier get your money from Barrett okay don't worry once I've been paid I'm gone 
This is your favorite Final Fantasy? Nice. I've never played it before. Sean, Sean gave me a copy of it on Steam during the 500th one hour stream. Uh, so we're checking it out. For probably about 10 more minutes and then it's time to go get the dog up and start dinner. It's nothing. You look a bit tired, that's all. Um, I did install it. It's installed on Steam Deck. Uh, is there a save point in town, Sean? Anybody? Is there a place that I can save the game right now? Or can I just save it? Can't. It's grayed out. There's got to be a safe place in here with all these conversations, right? What are my thoughts? Um, I really hate random encounters. That's thought number one. Don't remember where the closest safe is. Oh, that sucks. Maybe it's down here in the hideout. <clears throat> Random encounters just, they don't excite me, they frustrate me. Uh, but otherwise, I'm enjoying this just fine. Yo, Havoc, there's something I wanted to ask you. Was there anyone from Soldier fighting us today? No? No, and I'm positive. Well, aren't you, Mr. Confident? Yes. If you guys had fought with Soldier, you wouldn't be alive right now. Don't give a damn. Don't give me that crap. Uh, just cause you were one of them. Havoc. Yeah, you're strong. What? Maybe all of them guys... Maybe all of them guys in Soldier are. But don't forget your ass belongs to Avalanche now. Don't get no idea about siding with Shinra. Siding with Shinra? You asked me a question and I answered it, that's all. I'm gonna back up. I wanna talk about my money. I'm going back up, I wanna talk about my money. Wait, Havoc. Tifa, let him go. Looks like he misses Shinra. Shut up. I don't, I don't give a damn about Shinra or Soldier. But don't get me wrong, I don't care about the planet or Avalanche either. Did he just decide to start shooting up the wall? What's he doing? Oh, he's rapid. Okay, Hit his punching sound. Alright, fine. Please make up with everyone, okay? Money? Well, a lot was promised, after all. Yeah, definitely we hadn't agreed- Oh, he's on the phone, maybe? I guess this means I'll be reviewing our budget. Oh, it's Havoc. I think he heard me. Where's my money? Give me my money. You say you don't care, but you're still here talking to me. Well, you really want our friends, right? If you say so. You just kind of look lonely. I think we're the same. I'm here if you need me, Havoc. Marn. Daddy, you're so cute. What? What a weird statement. Our money. Well... E bag this this girl a little bit just a little bit please make up with everyone what I did no I'm gonna leave now I talked to everybody who would speak to me. <clears throat> Click on the pinball machine to get out, I did. Didn't I? Hey, 
Havoc, I'm asking you to join us. No. Tifa, I'm sorry, but... The planet's sick. Slowly but surely, it's dying. Someone has to do something. Barrett and his buddies are on the case, aren't they? It's nothing to do with me. So you're really leaving? You're just gonna walk right out on your childhood friend? How can you say that? And you forgot the promise? Promise? So you did forget. Remember Havoc, it was seven years ago. My hair was shorter then. The village water tower. Do you remember? Yeah, back then. I thought you'd never ask. I thought, I thought you'd never come. And it was getting a little cold. Pout. 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 Sorry I kept you waiting. <laughs> Pout. Well, you said you wanted to tell me something. <clears throat> Come this spring, I'm leaving the village for Midgar. All the boys are leaving, aren't they? I'm different uh, from the rest. I'm not after any old job. You need to play the remake. Yeah, I want to. I I kind of want to play it now too. I played the demo, and it didn't immediately click, but it sure was pretty. I want to join Soldier. I'm gonna be the best, just like Sephiroth. Sephiroth. The Great Sephiroth? Okay, bye. What the fuck are you doing? Isn't it hard to join Soldier? Well, I won't be able to come back to the village for a while. <clears throat> Is it? The, the remake of this is unfinished, right? It's like one-third of the game? Because this game is like 700 hours long, isn't it? Hmm. Pow. Will you make the headlines? Is there any news on when, like, part two is coming for that? I feel like that's that came out like when three, four years ago at this point. It's been a while. It took the first five hours and turned it into a 40 hour game. Gotcha. I'll do my best. Hey, promise me something. Uh, if you become famous and I'm ever in trouble, you'll come save me, alright? What? If I'm ever in a bind, a hero will show up and rescue me. I'd like to experience that at least once, wouldn't you? Meanwhile, Havoc is like, is it going to get me laid? Because if it's not... <laughs> what? Come on, promise me. Alright, I promise. They're right at the beginning of COVID, yeah. You remember now, don't you, our promise? I'm not a hero. I'm not famous either. Uh, I can't keep the promise. Because you fulfilled your childhood dream, you, jo you joined Soldier. So come on. You have to keep the promise. Oh my god, just ride the elevator, you show off. Hey, wait a minute, big time soldier. <clears throat> a promise is a promise. Here, take it. 1500 gil. Barrett's savings. Sweet! We're done then. R roll credits. We got paid.
This is my pay. You can do better than that. Uh, so you'll... Got the next job lined up. Double it. 3,000. What did you just say? It's okay. It's okay. Listen. We need all the help we can get, right? Alright, Sean. Have a great night. I'll be wrapping up soon. Probably gonna see if it'll fire up on the... If I can find a save point, that is. See if it'll fire up on the Steam Deck. Uh, the rest is for Marin schooling. Actually, I should probably figure out how to get the mod on the Steam Deck first, so there isn't some discrepancy in save files. <clears throat> 2000. Thanks, Havoc. We need a save point. Is what we need. Thanks for the, the game, Sean, by the way. I will look at playing more of it. Probably not on stream. Alright, old school Jay. Wait, are you gonna stream this week? You seem to be around. I don't understand why I woke up down here. Did he throw me down the arcade cabinet? Hold. What the fuck? Why did I... Why was I down there? Good morning, Havoc. Sleep well. Barrett's snoring is ridiculous. Uh, next to you, who wouldn't? Oh, I don't know what you mean. I tried. <laughs> oh, what the fuck, Jay? That face, though. Is that Jar Jar Banks? What is that? Golem. That is a face. Our targets make a reactor 5, head for the station. I'll fill you in on the train. <clears throat> uh, Havoc? Before the next mission, I got something I need to ask. See, the thing is, I don't really know how Materia works. I'll give you. I'll give you the one we found. Just teach me how to use it. Okay. Um, the pressure was really stressing you out. Sure, I'll explain how material works. Um. First, access the menu. You know, basic commands, right? Press that to get to the menu. Uh, use the directions to move the cursor. Oh, it says tutorial flashing out the bottom, like that, okay? Uh huh. I select the menu by pressing circle. We miss you, Jay. <clears throat> Anyways, let's get to it. It's like to you what the axe, that's it. <sighs> Pay close attention to my weapon. Like an armor, it has slots. Choose what slot you want to put the materia in. <clears throat> now select the materia you want to use. Looks like restore. Restore magic. If you want to know what else, what effect, what its effect is, line the cursor up with the check. Check. And press O. Okay. It's like selecting battle commands. Just slide the cursor up with magic. Man, I got the on so bad right now. As you can see that there are more spells available. <laughs> now you can use the magic called cure. 
And that's all there is to equipping materia. This needed a tutorial? I guess. I'm just surprised there wasn't any more, like, super, like, drag you by the nostrils through the game tutorials until just now. Because <clears throat> they've shown that they were willing to do it. It's as easy as pointing to the materia slot and pressing that. Okay. There's just one more thing you need to watch out for. When you equip the material, your condition changes. Part of you becomes stronger, while other parts become weaker. Oh, okay. Normally, when you equip magic materia, your magic becomes stronger, but your physical strengths become weaker. Well, we don't want that for somebody who uses a sword, huh? So, materia, materia is kind of a double-edged sword. The left side of the screen shows the effect the materia has on you. It's wise to o not o not to overuse magic materia. <laughs> Experiment with it on your own. That's about it. I'll explain more advanced things another time. Shit! The hell was all that about? Not so tough. What the hell is all that not tough so tough crap about? Okay. I didn't get a word of it. You handle the materia. Materia system. You can equip materia by opening the menu and selecting materia. That's what they could have told me. I'm coming along with you this time. Oh yeah? Havoc? The guy on the second floor of the weapon store told me he has something for you. Don't forget. Marin, the bar is in your hands. This 12 year old? Alright. I'd, I'd like to do the save game, please. Thank you. When can I do the save game? Second floor of the weapon store. Another slow day. Hey, this keeps up. My store is going under. So it's medicines. Okay. Ooh, oh, would you look at that? You're telling me you're a customer? <clears throat> Great, welcome. We buy, sell. Can you save? No. <clears throat> How do I get in there? That's why Jotty gone. Just like that. Years of rivalry. Truth is, I'm a lonely guy when I'm not drinking. Oh. Okay. Soldiers. Oh, no entry. Okay. Well, here's the crew. Guess we're back on the train. Yo! This ain't reserved. Split up, split up. Packed with hoodlums again. God. Don't I just have any luck? Huh? Huh? What? What the? What? Hey. This train's almost empty. Where is everybody? Eek! Maybe it's like that because of guys like you. Yippee! I mean, yipes. You've... You've seen the news, right? Avalanche threatened more attacks. 
Only devoted Shinra employees like me would go to Midgar on a day like today. You work for Shinra, son of a bitch! Shinra manager. I won't give in to violence, I won't even if you even give you my seat. <clears throat> Shit, you got lucky. So what's the plan? I didn't really understand that interchange, not gonna lie. Are Do you have to be so damn calm about everything? You're busting my rhythm. Uh-oh. Looks like they finished connecting the cars, we're leaving. Tell me about the mission. Ah, oh, look who's fired up about work. Yeah, I guess I gotta explain. Jesse's probably told you there's an inspection at the plate boundary. Pizza plate inspection. Ex uh, uh, whatever. Forgot how it works. Inspection, if you will. There we go. It's a system that performs the ID check on each car. Which Shinra loves to boast about, of course. Our fake IDs won't work there. Thank you for traveling with us. We'll be arriving at District 4 at 11.45 Midgard time. This means we're only three minutes from the checks. Alright, in three minutes we're jumping off this train. Got it? Havoc, over here. Let's take a look at the routes. You've seen this before. Oh well, come a little closer. That's odd, the ID check should be further down. Type A security alert. Unknown IDs detected. Emergency check on all cars. I repeat, type A security alert. If unknown IDs detected, emergency check on all cars. What? The hell's going on? We're in trouble. I'll explain later. Hurry up to the next car. Shit, someone blew it. Preparing to lock doors. Move, move, keep moving. Car door one locked. Moving to security level two. Hurry, the door's locked. ID detected, car two. Keep running, sign for plan B. Car door two locked, security level three. Oh, we're in the clear. Not yet. The next check starts soon. They'll find us, we're finished. Uh, but don't worry, if we keep moving up the train, we should be alright. I cannot believe there has not been a save point. Unknown passengers moving to the front half of the train, confirming present location. Oh fuck. Ha ha ha, thanks. What? Come on! Come on, y'all stop lollygagging. Let's fucking go. What is your... All right, we made it. Yo, over here. Let's go, we're diving out. This is not what I had in mind. Too late for that now. Why'd you come along anyways? Because. There ain't no time for that. Okay, I'm ready. Here I go. You don't care if I go first. A leader stays till the end. Get on with it. Don't go getting... Don't go getting your spiky ass hurt. This mission's just started. Later, you handle the rest. Toodles, roly-poly kid.
Good, so far everything's as planned. Oh my god, jumping out of a train in this environment would end you up dead. I thought they'd be, like, in the desert or something. <clears throat> Don't let your guard down. We still gotta get to Reactor 5. Biggs, Wedge, Jesse. We've... Have gone, have gone ahead of us. Let's go. Reactor 5, just down this tunnel. Oh, look. A random encounter. Still no save point. With tunnel radar turrets. Okay. Oh, rocket launchers! Light beams are Shinra's security sensors. We can't go any further. Man, that's one tight fit. We have to go under the plate from here. Arr. 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 What do you want to do? Jump down. Damn, man, this gives me the chills. Just do it. Shut down all the garbage levels. Uh, all the garbage smashers on the detention level. Hey, Team Wildwood, welcome in. Thanks so much for the raid. How are y'all doing today? I just wanted to pick up the bucket, the belt bottle. And now we've got Duckwork Horsefish. Rolling Claw, okay. Can I get a shout out for Matt's Game Room and uh, Team Wildwood if I have a mod available? Oh, you guys were working on, on Gauntlet just now? Nice. I'm sad I missed that. Jealous. That looks so fun. That's my kind of disaster, too. Good to see you. Thank you so much for the raid. <clears throat> We're playing Final... Well, you guys know what it is. It's Final Fantasy VII. It was a gift from Sean Beanland. Great gift. Bullshit is that? <laughs> yeah, there is a sixty FPS mod on. Um, use them. Reunion. The Reunion, it's called. Hell Bubbles. Yeah, it does look good. It looks really good. How do this mod? Uh, go to the PC Gaming Wiki page. There's a link for it there. What I really need is a checkpoint, though. I can't believe we haven't found one.
the reactor's up this way. I find a, a checkpoint. Well, well. See if the save games will pop over onto the Steam Deck. Which is probably where I would continue to play this if I were to continue playing it. I'm not planning on streaming this one fully. Maybe one day, but. <clears throat> not right now. I want to play some short games for a while on the extra streams. Which start tomorrow with Defiance because we're done with Fallout. I'm gonna go up the ladder then. Hey, Captain Peel Card, how are you doing today? I'm so sorry it's my fault we didn't clear the checkpoint. Uh, it was your card, Havoc. I think I overdid it. I put my heart into it, but I failed. Okay, well. We'll stay on the other way, then. What? Hey, there's there it is. There's a safe point. That's what we've been looking for. Why would that be the alternate route? No! God damn it! I just want to save! Oh, I fucking hate random encounters. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. I don't have time for this. Oh, you dickholes. <laughs> <clears throat> and watch, watch. I'm gonna get killed here, too. And it's gonna be like an hour ago, the last time I saved. I have no idea, Cat Peel Card. That's all this game is, though, is random encounters. This is the Steam release, right? Yeah, I think you can. Oh, okay. I mean, the Steam release is barely, uh, barely improved with the original CD-ROM version. do you have? Get me to the checkpoint. Okay. Now that we've done that, we're going to ult that for this. Closes this chat window because the KVM is on the wrong computer. <laughs> Let's try that again. At least I didn't close, um... Uh... OBS. Done that before. <clears throat> oh yeah, you are on. Uh, yeah, this is the one I'm using here. Is the reunion? You go to PC Gaming Wiki. It's right there on their page. Uh, but it adds, you know, 60 FPS, all that good stuff.
If you push down both the right and left sticks, you can disable random encounters. Really? Can you beat the game without getting XP ever? Is that possible? Uh, yeah. Wait a second. 39 minutes is very wrong. What are you, like, not connected to the internet or something? No, oh, you're there. There we go. 2.5 hours. Well, that took a second to update. Faced allegation of in insider trading related to anti-Biden cryptocurrency. Let's go... Brandon Crypto Coin. He also faced allegations of having an appropriate financial relationship with the staffer. Uh, not all encounters are random, and you'd be pretty. It is funny. Okay. Game's launcher does not support controllers, so use the mouse. Yep. Got that part. So I added. Um. A screen protector to this. Um, D brand. I put that on this weekend. So you can see my reflection in it because, you know, it makes it reflective where, you know, it was, um, it says 1280 by 800, 60 hertz network. Use cloud saves. There we go. Testing, checking, good. That's good. That's what we want. There you go. Joysticks are all picked up. It's got the keyboard too, if you want, I guess. Keep aspect ratio, original graphics mode, linear filtering. Well, let's hit play. <clears throat> um, select quit. I think it wants me to hit C on this screen. Or X, whatever it was. Select quit in the game menu. My save files have been synced. How do we progress forward here? I think this is one of the things one of the, the mod would have to fix. Enter hit send, huh? One thing I've noticed about the keyboard um, here on the Steam Deck is that there's no escape key. Which is weird. I guess Jankos have to make a comeback. Oh man, I would never put this in a pocket. No, I, I death grip this thing on the side right here. I death grip it. Anytime I have to carry it, like it's either two hands like this, or I'm like fully death gripping this so I don't drop it. I am terrified. I am terrified of breaking this thing. So, yeah, X is okay. And X should do its thing, but it's not. Let's put the uh, let's put this controller on it um, because with the mod, I think the uh... there we go. So that got me past it. So I needed a keyboard to get past that. Uh, then you. So there's no save games here. There's no save games here. It said save games were synced. Uh, I don't like that. So do the mod save games, are they not with the Steam Cloud then? They must be separate. Hey, Lost Wolf. Oh, no. No, we played it. We played it. I had it all set up. I just I just wrapped up, hit a save point, and I was going to see if I could pick it back up on the Steam Deck. Um, but it seems like... The save file didn't come over, but I'm also running the Reunion mod on PC, which I may need to install here. No, we played. We played for two hours. Um... I'm just doing the, uh, does it run? Save file ha is Steam Cloud. Um, save file is Steam Cloud, but the mod might have changed that. 
Um, but like if you go in here to its launcher, it's not listed on the store page, but it is right here under settings, um, under network. There you go. Use uh, cloud saving. And it is it is there. It's on. <laughs> we'll give it one more try here. <clears throat> Yeah, see, it says save files have been synced. Uh, but there's nothing there when you hit continue. Actually, here's my next question. Um, is this... Was I supposed to be getting achievements where I was in this game? Because the mod might have disabled achievements. Fun fact. And someone may have talked you into trying Fallout 3 because you're trying more shooters. That's awesome. I think you'll enjoy it. Alright, your stuff. Let's look at the achievements here real quick. One first battle. Brave. Use Cloud's first limit. Use Barrett's first limit. Tifa. Start a battle in Battle Square. Yeah, you're gonna before you you dive into Fallout Three, you're really gonna want to spend some time on the PC Gaming Wikipedia page for that. Um, if you're using any computer newer than Vista, I feel like using the mod might have disabled achievements. Oh no, it's not a bad thing, Lost Wolf. It's not it, nothing too complicated. Yeah, because I know I used Cloud's first limit when we were fighting that boss. Um, but I may need to do some reading. It's kind of a bummer. So maybe when I when I if I go to full play this on here, I wouldn't do that with the mod if I wanted achievements. <clears throat> I don't know. Kind of a bummer. One game I wish would work on the Steam Deck is Just Cause 2, and it just and it just ain't going. Anything you need to be particularly aware of? Uh, the one that I remember that was a really bad one was that the game was designed to run on like one or two cores. Um, so there's some there's some I and I file editing you have to do to get that to work. Otherwise, it'll crash randomly. Something will spawn off in the distance and the game will just crash. Uh, but yeah. I'm going to find somebody to raid, go get the dog up, because he's been in the kennel for a while now. And, uh... Actually, here, we can look together. Real quick, before I take off. Um, so they it, they did this used to be a real problem. You'd have to install some very like it was miserable uh, to get the games for Windows Live thing working. But I think that that's been removed now. Yeah, large address aware uh, games for Windows Live disabler. The Steam version of the game out of the box is not Windows when optimized for Windows eight and above. The GOG version features... So the GOG version, I guess that's the way to buy it. I mean, you can still fix the Steam version. It'll be fine. But it looks like they fixed a bunch of stuff here. Oh, no. The GOG version are officially pre-patched to 1.7. Okay. Oh, it was a downgrader patch if you want to support older mods that never got updated.
female pit boy fix. Oh, for the arm clipping? I remember that. Uh, games for Windows Live Disabler. If that's a problem, go here. Get this mod, it'll fix it. Everybody's got their own instructions, I'm sure. Uh, this one, this was a big one. To let the game use more than 3 gigs of RAM. Uh, because the game runs like shit if you have more than 3 gigs of RAM. So the large address aware is going to be a thing you need. Multi-core threading. This one was a big one. Uh, out of memory fix decreases overall RAM usage. But yeah, this website right here, you're running an older game or even a newer game. PC Gaming Wiki is like... Um, it's, a, it's a shining light cast down on us from the clouds. From the gaming gods. Oh... Uh. You can find information here on multi-monitor support if you wanted that. <clears throat> uh, yeah, game randomly crashes. The multi-core fix here. An issue for MP3 codecs causing skipping on the Pit Boy radio. There's some good mods. One of the one of the big gripes that I had to fix with the mod in Cyberpunk 2077 was the map, the mini map. Like the little mini map in the corner is too damn small. You can't drive a fast car with it. You'll you never see the turns coming in time. So I added a mod that let it, like, the faster you went, the smaller it got, like, the more zoomed out it got. And when you got out of the car, it zoomed in. It was really fucking nice. That that changed. That was my big gripe with that game. I, I hated that so much. And then a mod fixed it, and I was really happy about that. But yeah, thanks, everybody. Thanks, everybody, for being here. If you guys weren't here when I started the stream, I'm going to share this again. Because I made a new intro logo sequence that I'm really happy with. Uh, replacing the old the old stinger. Um, and then we're going to find somebody to raid. But here's this. Thanks, y'all. I stayed up way too late on that last night. We're gonna go hang out with Monique. We're gonna go hang out with Monique. I think that's what Big D meant by the knee queen. <laughs> that dog is really getting after the barking, so... If you haven't, if you haven't hung out with Mockney RC, I still just call her Monique. She's awesome. She's delightful. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Tomorrow, we've got whatever the schedule says it is, and then tomorrow night, we're starting a new extra stream game, which is going to be Defiance. We're going to be playing some classic, or, well, vintage PC Windows 95 games. <laughs> because we're done with Fallout New Vegas. It's over. I'll have a great day. Thank you, Skep. You too. All of you, thank you for being here. Wildwood, Lost Wolf, Captain Peel card. Mac Lad. Nigel Skep. Everybody else that's lurking. Big D. I think that's Moni. Like, more like Morni. Maybe. It used to be Monique. We all called her Monique because that's the way it was spelled. Like, correct. Uh, make sure y'all follow each other, because you're all all are awesome streamers. Because this is a stream for other streamers, apparently. 
All right, have a great night. There we go.